I want to sell t-shirts, but I'm poor. I don't have money. I don't have space. I don't know how to draw. I have no graphic designing skills. My back hurts. Well, there's no more excuses because today I'm going to show you how to start a t-shirt business with only $20. And you don't even need expensive equipment. Actually, you don't need any type of equipment. All you really need is a computer or a laptop. No, this is not print on demand. What's print on demand? Print on demand is a third party company where you sell your artwork, but they take care of everything. They print your t-shirts, they pack your t-shirts, and they ship your t-shirt. Now me personally, I like to have full control of what I'm selling. I want to make sure that the quality is right, the feel is right, and the print is right. Especially if I'm selling to family and friends. Anyways, let me give you a quick introduction. My name is Milo, and I've been printing t-shirts for a little bit over 4 years. But I've been studying the industry for a little bit over 5. And everything that I have learned, I love sharing. I love teaching, I love motivating, I love inspiring. It's just something that builds me up. For example, I show you guys how to start a t-shirt business with only $500. With a cheap Amazon press, with a heat press, on a low budget. I show you guys how I started my business. And this is just one of those videos, but with only $20. Oh, only $20. So make sure to hit the like button because it motivates me to keep doing content. Now, let's get to work. So we're going to go to this free website called Kittle. That's gonna help us create a design, print a design, and of course, when we receive the garments, we're gonna test that print. We gotta check the quality of the design. If you have never heard of Kittle, here's a quick introduction. So Kittle is a website where you could easily create beautiful designs in minutes. It has hundreds or even thousands of different templates that you can snatch, recreate, and use them for your own personal projects or commercial projects. So yes, everything's legal. All right, let's scroll through these templates. Let's go to t-shirts. And I'm looking for a front chest print. I'm looking for something very simple, but also uh, very detailed, if that makes any sense. And let's keep scrolling. Let's see, something got to pop up. That caused my attention. So I found a design that I like called Keen, Keen Graffiti. I like the graffiti style. Not too bad, not too bad. Let's use this one. And here's the thing. When you find a design that you like, try to make it as unique as possible. Like by changing the colors, colors, changing the colors, changing the font, just so you can stand out from the rest. Okay, so this is the creating side of Kittle. And the first thing that I want to do, I want to change that word to uh, that king word, to the only king that I know. That's Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Jesus is the only king that I know. And I don't like the colors, so we're gonna, we're gonna mess with these colors. Let me delete this quick. Delete that. And just look at how easy it is. It's really not that hard. You really don't need like graphic designing skills to do simple stuff like this. And I just had to fast forward through the whole design because I don't wanna waste your time. I don't want you guys just looking at me changing different colors. It's kind of boring, but uh, at least you got the idea. But if you guys do want to see me create a design from scratch like that, let me know in the comments. I don't mind doing a video for you guys. Okay, now that we finished creating our design, it's time to go print it. And Kittle just came out with this new feature called Kittle Print, where you're able to bring a design to life and have them deliver it to your doorstep. Pretty awesome, right? And of course, thank you Kittle for sponsoring this video. If you guys want to try this website for free, I'm going to add the link in the bio. Okay, so I'm going to show you how simple it is to order your t-shirts. But before we do any ordering, let's check out this mock-up plugin right here that they have. This mock-up feature that they have. It's pretty awesome. Just so you can have an idea how the design is going to look on the t-shirt. And of course, you can change the color t-shirts or whatever. It's pretty awesome. All right. But let's go back. We'll come back that we'll come back to that later on. Let's focus right now on ordering, and it's really simple. You're gonna click up here export and you're gonna get two options. Then you're gonna click uh, print your design. You're gonna have t-shirts, hoodies, mugs, and totes. But we're gonna focus on t-shirts right now. And since the um, feature uh, is, is, is really new, they don't have a lot of options. They only have two uh, t-shirts right now on stock, but you get so many different colors. Look at all these colors. Look at all those chickens. All right. And it's the same price for medium and 5X. So it's not that bad. Extra small, same price. This is the price that you pay per t-shirt. Now let's go to um, checkout so you can see shipping. 
So this is the shipping fee. So in total, you're paying a $22.69. Obviously, if you order more t-shirts, the price per shipping drops down because it splits through the whole t-shirt. So we're just gonna round that up to $20 per t-shirt if you order more than uh, eight t-shirts. So I just ordered my garments. And while we wait, let's talk numbers. Let's just say to produce a t-shirt, it's gonna cost $20. Now we're gonna sell each t-shirt at 30 bucks a piece. Note this, we're selling only to family and friends for now. We're only focusing on local. So we don't have a website, we don't have a store. The only thing that we have right now is our social medias that are free. Okay, so we're selling each t-shirt at 30 bucks a piece. Mine is the $20 to produce that t-shirt. That leaves us with $10 of profit. $10 don't seem much, but for putting in no work to create that t-shirt, $10 is a lot. And let's just say, our goal is to make an extra $500 a month. So the math is pretty easy. To make those 500 bucks, we gotta sell 50 t-shirts. And here's the beautiful thing. You don't have to do no labor work or anything. All you have to do is focus on marketing the business and getting sales. That's it. Of course, when you start buying your equipment and you start printing your own t-shirts, your profit margin will go up. But for right now, you don't have anything. So let's work with what we have. And just seeing the numbers beforehand helps you set a goal. It's really motivating because it gives you a small glance of the finish line. All right, let's check the quality. And I didn't order a t-shirt because I believe that it's harder to print on a sweater. So if the quality comes out good on a sweater, then I can assure you that it's also gonna look good on a t-shirt. And this is my honest review. I actually like the feel and the vibrancy of the print. It's definitely ink, it's definitely ink, but it's not screen printed. So I'm like a good 90% sure it was made out of a DTG printer. But anyways, Thumbs up for this sweater. So the easy part is over. Starting the business and setting the goal. Now, the hard part is getting sales. But don't worry, I'm gonna show you three easy marketing tricks that has helped me get more sales. We're gonna do a small pre-sale, a small photo shoot, and we're gonna show you how to make your t-shirt stand out. Something that has worked great for me in the beginning of my journey was to do pre-sales. I will start first by creating mock-ups. And you can easily create mock-ups here on Kittle. And here's the beautiful thing. You could do regular digital mock-ups like this one, or you could do more realistic mock-ups like this one, this one, or even this one. Pretty awesome, right? After you finish creating your mock-ups, now it's time to start sharing them with family and friends and start posting them on your social media outlet. Now, me personally, I will run that whole pre-sale for a full week. This helps to collect the funds for the t-shirts since we're starting with no money. And here's another beautiful thing. You could do more than just one design. You could do a pre-sale for three designs, four designs, five designs, even 10 designs. Just saying, now it's time to bump it up a notch. I'm gonna do a small photo shoot. This is gonna help you have more content to post, especially when you're doing that pre-sale. On top of that, customers love to see those realistic uh, mock-ups, you know, realistic images, realistic photos. It just gives them that assurance to purchase your, your t-shirts. Let's go back to Kittle because they have this awesome AI tool that helps you remove the background of your picture. Just like that. So now we can start messing with the background or start adding and decorating the picture. Or we could go to one of their social media templates, grab them and recreate them to fit our style. Now here's the thing, with the free version, you won't have access to all the Kittle tools. You will have to upgrade to the pro version or even the expert version. But here's the awesome part, click the link below for a 30 day free trial. But you gotta hurry though because the code expires November 4. And here's the last marketing trick to make your t-shirt stand out. Branding your t-shirts will help them stand out. For example, by removing the neck tag of this t-shirt and adding your own personal tag in there will make this t-shirt more unique. But if you can't afford custom tags, do this instead. Most of the t-shirts come with two tags, the brand tag and the label tag, the size tag. So what you wanna do, just remove the brand tag. So like that, nobody knows what type of t-shirt brand you're working with. Another easy thing that you can do is buy poly bags and pack them in there really nice and beautiful. It's just something really easy that makes them stand out, makes you look professional, and they just look pretty. And you can find these on Amazon. I think it's like 100, 100 of these bags for $15. So that's like 15 cents each poly bag. Not too bad. You guys gotta understand that it's those little things that make a huge difference. And here's my last tip. Create video content. It is the best way right now to get sales. Well, at least for my shop. 
And I did a whole video on this topic. So go check it out. I break the whole uh, process into little tiny steps so you guys can understand the full picture. Once again, thank you so much for the love and support. Have a beautiful day and God bless you all.